at uh, Cannes in, in general in the world of advertising. It is three entities now. It's traditional agencies, it is tech companies and it is consultants. So having said that, uh, you know, how bullish are you on Razorfish, on Sapient Razorfish? I made the acquisition of Sapient because I knew that our business was going to move in the territory of technology and consulting. And uh, when I made that decision, people were looking uh, at me with, uh, okay, big question mark, uh, maybe Moise is becoming crazy, maybe it's a wrong decision, etc. Now they see that there is Accenture who is in Cannes, there is Deloitte who is in Cannes, there is many companies, IBM, etc., tech companies, wine can or consulting firms, and uh, they say, oh, maybe Morris was not that wrong. Huh? And I think that uh, Sapient is representing the future. That's clear, because it will help our client transforming the relationship with uh, the consumers and transforming their own business, transforming marketing and their organization. And therefore, what we are offering to our clients is something which is second to none, which is an end-to-end -end service, starting with consulting, developing the platform, developing the marketing strategy, uh, the work, the communication platform, executing this brilliantly, and helping them winning market share and winning growth. And this is what we do, and they believe that um, Sapient Razorfish will be key for our future. Yeah. Is the uh, power of one practical? Oh yes, definitely. And uh, we see a lot of uh, uh, people in our organization who are already working under the power of one. It is probably one of the most brilliant idea that we had. And uh, we, we started with the idea of power of one in April, April, uh, 2015. So it's something which, um, and um, we promoted it in uh, uh, the uh, seminar that we organized with 350 of our people in San Francisco. And we decided to implement it in December uh, 2015. We took the full year of 2016 to implement it. We got the immediate result. And you see many of our clients, when they see that um, we, we can bring together people from different horizons and working together under one single leadership. It's something that they love because they see that they, they are themselves unleashing our assets yeah. and using uh, uh, all our power. And that is the power of one. And this is probably one of the greatest idea we had at Publicis to transform our business and uh, it is something which is there to last and you will see a lot of uh, uh, development around Power of One and by the way uh, Marcel is one of the applications. So is, you're saying he's practical with Power of One? Absolutely. Okay, uh, you have a new French president Emmanuel yes. Macaroon. How will he impact France and your business? I love the fact that uh, we, France, which is an old country, has been able to elect a president of 39 years old with no party. Uh, he had no party a year ago and with only ideas and the president who has refused populism and who has said to uh, the French people, I love Europe. I think Europe is uh, what will help us to grow in the future. I hate populism and we have tough days ahead of us, but all together we will work hard and we will win. And he has not been complacent and he has not tried to sell something that we see very often, which is uh, populist ideas and he, he stood firm on his ideas. He has been fantastically well elected. He's 
party, because since then he has created the party, uh, has been elected uh, marvelously, and uh, he will have a, the vast majority at uh, the Assemblée Nationale, and he will be empowered to do all the changes that our country needs to do. So now, as always, the proof is in the pudding. And uh, what we are expecting is that he will reform France, he will help us to change our old habits, and he will change many of our cumbersome laws and all the things which have been inherited from the past, which are no longer uh, in line with the new world. So uh, I'm excited, I think he's uh, great, is fast, is uh, coming from the new generation, and this is hope for Europe. When you see him in uh, the meeting yesterday in, in Brussels with all the head of states, uh, there is a, a fresh air of optimism in Europe, and including in the world. People are looking at France uh, with different eyes, so I think that uh, an old country with old tradition, uh, with um, uh, a, a background which was not always very good, the socialist on the one hand, the Front National on the other, have been strong enough to elect a young president, to change dramatically the Assemblée Nationale, and to say, here are the keys, Monsieur President, and please reform the, that country. I think it's great. Yeah, so what is the kind of impact that you expect on your business? You know, I'm not expecting that um, it will drive my business or that it will impact my business. What I'm expecting is that it impacts France. Yeah. And if it does so, it will impact the economy and it will impact Europe. And Europe will be again at the forefront of growth and this will impact my business. Yeah. So I, I love this idea that he should not care about my business, but he should care about my country. Yeah. So, you know, uh, Arthur is taking, uh, you know, charge of the company at the same, same age, 45, at the time when you did. What is uh, your advice to Arthur? He should follow his instinct. Uh, I, I have been fortunate enough to run the company my way. He has to run the company his way. Yeah. And do you like his way? I, so far, I love it. <laughs> All right. Thank you so much. Thanks for speaking to us. No, thank you.